Hey guys, this is X Reborn X Love X here, and I have a very exciting video for you guys. I can't actually remember if I actually ever did upload one of these videos, but if you can guess by the title, yes, it is a Reborn nursery tour, and um, I kind of switched it around like this is like the fifth time I've reorganized it, but I don't think I ever really made you guys a proper video. Well, actually, wait, no, I did make you guys a video at one time, but I did change it a lot. Right now, this whole, from there, from right in front of this pink box to here, this area is not part of the nursery. This is, like, part of my briar stuff, which I'm not, I, I use it for my photography, my photography for briars. And I still have to move it out, and then this is my, this, you don't know what that is, but it's these little stress balls I collect. They're called squishies, but, um, yeah, so... This is the Reborn Nursery Tour, and I'm going to start right here. So, right here I have the Bouncer. It's from Bright Stars, and it's a kind of, sort of a boy's bouncer, but I still put girls in it. And I have Mr. Jacob in here. Um, oh, and the wallpaper. I have wallpaper in here as well. I think I had that in my last video, but just in case you guys didn't know that. And then right next to the Bouncer, there. this is Lily's Bath Time kit but it says my name on it because that's my name but um this is Lily's bath time kit um, I'm actually gonna bathe Lily tonight even though it's super late this is the stepping stool it still has both the formulas and the baby room air freshener there's Lily's bathtub and then right here is the bassinet and inside we have Miss Maddie my toddler um and everyone's telling me she's like not a toddler and she's a baby but um I actually researched the Rowan kit and um, it is a toddler, but it, it's like a, a one-year-old or younger, so it's technically not, but I'm still gonna say she's a toddler, because I really want a toddler, so you know what? She's a toddler. A, a one-year-old can be a toddler, because, I mean, that technically is a toddler. Anyways, right here on, in this basket under here is, like, the blankets and pillows, and then some of the toys that the toddlers use, and that the babies use, and then on top is just a bunch of blank kits. I call them kits, but they're really just baby dolls I still have to reborn. I have tons of them in here. I have a lot of them I have to work on still. Um, in here, I have the um, Samsung Galaxy Tab charging, and I have a big box full of Webkins because they're all my old Webkins, and my babies like to use them because that's what I, instead of going out and buying lovies and stuff, I just use my Webkins as their stuffed animals. Um, and then here are the three little things here. So this is the boys' um, Sterilite thing drawers. On the bottom, it's more miscellaneous. I have, like, a bunch of Maddie's sippy cups and these little things. Then I have Xander's old jackets and a bunch of baby spoons and, like, a baby feeding journal log and a bunch of baby food that I made and a flashlight. So it's more of an emergency kit. Right here is all the boys' sleepers. Um... And then just the regular boy's clothes. I'm not going to go through it. If you guys want more detailed video, please ask me about that. And I have this little decoration here. It's just an angel bear. I have an old Avent bottle box. Um, and then I have, this is some, some Tiki Tack for um, passies. And I have a passy case right here, but it's unorganized. And here I have all the uns, um, unmodified pacifiers. And here I have some diapers, some lotion, and some commonly used hair accessories. And this is actually um, either Hazel or Willow's pacifier. I was just using it. So here's the mohair conditioner. But it's actually it's water right now because I didn't like the way the mohair conditioner was making my baby's hair. And I have the brushes. And then and here's the hair accessories. And then um, this is the girls thing. On the bottom is a mini pillow pet. Um, there's a bunch of miscellaneous girls' clothes. I have the, all the, like, ages and the, like, sizes and stuff all organized, but, yeah. And then right here is the changing table. So, right next to it, I have this jumbo pillow pet, the zebra. And on the bottom is the same. I just have my old diaper bag and a bunch of powder and lotion and these little mini feeding thingies. And then up here, I have just the diapers. Newborn, size 4, size 5, um, newborn, preemies, I have mainly preemie, um, because, yeah, and then up here, I don't think you can really see in there, but it's just a bunch of unused diapers and some unused formulas and things like that. 
it, basically everything unused or that I don't use often. Right here is the main part of the changing table. I changed the blanket to the winter theme because it's sort of cold out right now. So yeah, I took got rid of the summer and spring blanket. And I'm about to have to put the spring blanket right back up because I didn't change it for like five months. But here's Willow. She's I just put her in her, her sleeper and she's on the changing table and she looks so gorgeous. And I finally found out what her middle name is going to be. You're going to laugh at this, but it's Willow Georgia. Um, that's a really weird, it's really random, but I just, I don't know. I have a little Mickey Mouse plush, and then here's Willow's pictures. And then a lot, this is from um, Maya Melissa. Um, and this is also a care instructions for Maya Melissa. And um, over here is the main crib. Um, it's gender neutral. It's a, a port crib. Um, Right here is the boys' side, and right here is the girls' side. But I have, like, no boys, and it's so sad, and yeah. But anyway, here's Xander, which, um, true Reborn Mama, if you're watching this, I'm not going to be trading anymore because I had some people telling me some negative things um, about um, our whole trade, and then I also, my dad doesn't want me to trading him anymore because he's really heavy and we found out it was going to cost us over $65 to send him two-day priority. So I'm no longer trading Xander. I'm sorry. You probably already knew that because we haven't talked in over a month. But um, here's Xander. Um, he's the Tracy Badonna Rupert. Um, here's Liam. I reborn him. There's Oliver. He used to be Abby, but he's Joey Kit by Tosh Inholm. There's um, Emma. She's a reborn I did, um, but she's apparently on the boy side, and Erica as well. There's Kayla. She's a Shelby kit. Catherine is the Libby kit. Um, that's Jillian. She's a Lee Middleton. Sadie is a Sadie kit, and that's all in here. Um, over here is just the playpen area. I have one of my toddlers, Holly, and then another toddler, mainly just an older baby, but that's Emily and Lee Middleton. And then right here is Hazel. Um, she's about to go up there with Willow. I'm going to do a photo shoot. Right here, I just have, like, a gallery of babies just sitting. There's Blossom, one of my toddlers, Zelda, my zombie, um, Amber, my um, porcelain baby, and my antique baby, Stacy. And then there, here is, if you haven't seen the video, um, here is Aiden, the reborn, the crying baby I just made, and I just finished it today, and I love him. He's so awesome. Anyways... Um, over here is the little area where I keep like the bottles and Lily's stuff. Lily is my silicone baby. Um, however, more than half of my bottles are in my bathroom right now in the closet because I was cleaning them, so I need to bring them back out. I have around 40 bottles. This is not even half of my bottles. But um, I have Zeldin's blood and zombie brain bottles, and then I have a bunch of, like, formula bottles, and then I have all the rest of my bottles in my bathroom. Right here is where I keep all their birth certificates, and then here is my, most of Lily's stuff. Um, up here is the windowsill. I have all of my dog figures, like my Schleich dogs, and then I have this mini Lee Middleton baby and a bunch of other stuff over there, my crystals and stuff like that that I just have for decorations. This is the car seat. I have some antique baby dolls that are for sale in here, um, but the one in the back, this big one, is not for sale. Just these two on the side, um, but yeah, I'm having kind of a hard time selling them because they're kind of in bad condition, but um, yeah, they need to be moved out of there. Um, right here is Lily's crib, and under there is the mini car seat carrier thing, and here is Lily, my full body silicone. Um, anyways, I was thinking about selling her, but I'm no longer selling or trading her. I'm going to keep her. Um, right here is a miscellaneous container. I still need to find use for it. And then, I, of course, I have my squishies and then my briar stuff. And then over here is just the child reborns. Um, well, this is not a reborn, but this is Violet. Um, and then this is Sarah. Violet is a porcelain reborn. She is a reborn because the place I bought her from is a store. And this guy, he's basically... Um, he's not the artist, but there's a woman, an old lady that was the artist, and basically she takes porcelain, empty porcelain kits and paints them just as a reborn artist would paint a vinyl kit. So she's a reborn, the only difference is that she's porcelain instead of vinyl. But she's adorable, and she has, um, like three-fourth, I guess, well she has half arms and three-fourth legs, and 
She's absolutely adorable. She's like a three-year-old, I think. She's probably like 40 inches tall or something. Okay, not really. She's probably like 30 or like 20-something. And then Sarah is just a my twin. I'm actually going to be painting her soon. Um, but, yeah. That is my completed Reborn Nursery Tour. And I had a few questions um, saying, like, what's your nursery name? Like, because I am now an official Reborn artist, I guess you could say. I've done four babies. Um... And it's going to be called Moon Munchkin's Nursery. So tell me um, what you guys think about that. It was always Moon Munchkin's Nursery, but I'm just now announcing that to the public. So thank you guys for watching this video. And um, comment down below what you think of my nursery, any tips, um, what was your favorite part of my nursery, anything like that. So thank you guys for watching. Have a nice night. Bye.